What's up you guys, it's Julia. Welcome back to my channel. So today I am doing another fall fashion video. Today I'm showing you guys um, basically like my fall shoe guide. So every shoe that I think that you need for fall and a couple of these I've had multiple seasons and I've worn them over and over again. So I know that they're really, really um, like good staples that you can wear multiple years and I think literally majority of these shoes are under $50 so they're really affordable there's one pair that is an exception that is a little bit pricier for the most part very affordable achievable to get in a lot of variety so I hope this helps you guys with your fall shopping and trying out some new trends and stuff like that I'll have everything linked in the description box down below if you want to check it out and also I know I'm gonna get questions about this about my top my top is from revolve and I will have it linked in the description box down below as well and the size that I'm wearing so if you're new please subscribe and let me know what kind of videos you want to see here on my channel and let's hop into the shoe guide okay so the first is seriously my most worn pair of shoes ever I've had these through I think two fall seasons and they're still available on the website but they are these sock booties from boohoo and they are literally only like $25 you guys and I wore them all winter last winter and all fall and I'm still pulling them back out now um, for this year and they're still in great condition I wore them to the ground but they're kind of like a suede style sock booty really they look so high quality the toe is the perfect point it's very flattering and I literally wear these with everything they look so cute with jeans they look good with dresses skirts they're just like the most perfect classic black booty for fall i'm obsessed with them you need to get them um because i think they sold out last season but i checked on the website today and they have them back so i think i want to almost order like a new pair just because i love them so much but i think they're absolutely perfect and they're such a hidden gem they're so cute all right next a really big trend for fall is like white booties and so this is my one pair that is a little bit more expensive these are from zara and they're just like a pointy toe leather white booty i like them because they're a little bit shorter um, on the ankle and the heel is literally like a kitten heel it's like maybe two inches which is so nice because they're super comfortable you can walk forever in them because they're not very high and just really practical to wear like you could wear this to school work like whatever you do um, very practical but I love the white I feel like the white is so in it makes such a statement for fall and it's so cute um, but I have seen really really great dupes for these on pretty little thing and like misguided and forever 21 so i will link um those ones down below as well in addition to the zara ones but they literally look identical like the mini heel point leather like they're the exact same thing so if you're looking to spend a little bit less i will link those options as well but i love these and the pop of white is like really really cute against all the dark like fall colors like burgundies and stuff like that so i love these all right next if you follow me on instagram you know that i am loving animal prints for fall and i'm specifically obsessed with snakeskin so the first pair of snakeskin booties that i have are these really cute ones from cupid shoes and they're just a really simple kind of pointy toed booty with a nice and neutral snakeskin print. They're super cute um, and just a really nice statement. They kind of like zip up in the back, but again, a really nice kind of low heel, almost like that Western style that's really in. And I just think they're perfect. Um, really cute with like, an all black outfit or black and white and the snakeskin is just a really cute statement so I know in winter things can get a little bit boring and to have a little statement boot is super fun so love these ones and then these are my new babies I love these so much and these are from pretty little thing but they're also a snakeskin booty I don't know if they have them in solid colors they might so you could definitely do solid but I think they're such a fun twist on like a classic boot so they have these really cool kind of cutouts which are super fun they lace up and then they have buckles that cross over the top of the foot and up at the ankle and a nice point toe and what I love about these they're like literally an exact dupe for the Chloe boots. Chloe, the designer, makes boots that literally look just, just like this. Like somebody stopped me in New York and they asked me, they're like, oh, I love your boots. They're the Chloe ones, huh? And I go, uh, no, they're actually a dupe and they're only like 60 bucks. So they're or 60 or 50 around there, but they're so cute. Such a statement. I really like these with um, like skirts and maybe even like overalls. Like they're just a really cute pop and like statement on your foot. Um, that's just adorable. So 
kind of different, really fun twist on a booty, adds like a lot of interest, but I love them. Okay, moving on to sneakers, and then I'll move into heels. Some people really like this trend and some people don't, but there's kind of like this I like to call it like an orthopedic sneaker trend going on and Balenciaga kind of started it because they have these huge oversized chunky sneakers and I've been wearing them a ton but I recently got this pair from Windsor and they're really affordable but I love them because they're super white and really really crisp not overly chunky so if you're nervous about trying the trend out I feel like this is a good pair to kind of transition you into it and um, for fall, I think it's perfect because they have a little black detail with the little burgundy here, and it's really cute. So I've been wearing these with dresses, um, skirts, pants, everything. You can see them styled a million different ways over on my Instagram, but I'm really into this trend because it's practical. Like, it's so comfortable and it's super fashionable. So I love that. I definitely will be buying more chunky sneakers, but I think this is a really, really good solid pair that I've been going to a ton and it'll kind of match your darker like fall colors. Okay, next, don't kill me, but another <laughs> snake skin option. These are also from Cupid Shoes and they have these honestly in a million different patterns. So I'll link them below and you can see all of the options. They have leopard, they have solid colors, but I went for the snake skin because I'm obsessed and they're kind of more of like a brown tone snake brown toned snake skin, but I love this style. It's just like a nice simple slide, like slip on shoe, kind of looks like Vans, but I think the snake skin gives them like a little bit of a fashionable twist and it makes them super cute. So it takes it from basic and kind of steps it up a little bit and just really like these would be great for school with, with jeans and a hoodie. They're just adorable and they come in tons of patterns. So super affordable. I love these and easy kind of like fast slide on that looks really cute. All right, next I have a couple couple of pair of heels and I recently got a ton of shoes from Boohoo and guys, they really, Boohoo has some good shoes. I would like continue to check their site because they like those are where my favorite booties are from and I've gotten a ton of heels from there that I love as well. Um, so these would I would say are a little more fall transitional but they're kind of like a wrap style heel and to me they kind of look like the ones from Revolve that are super expensive. Um, so this is kind of a more affordable version, but I just love them. The heel's a little bit chunkier and they're more of like a suede material. So that kind of warms them up and makes them more fallish. And I'm wearing them a ton right now. I think maybe once it gets to winter, they might be a little cold, but I think they're perfect for, for fall and just transitioning. So really cute, lots of like wraps and you wrap them up the ankle. They're just adorable and they're a nice like twist on a basic heel. They add a little more interest. Also, am obsessed with these heels from Boohoo. So they're a really cute pointy toe pump, but they have this really cute mesh kind of polka dot lining at the front that makes them a little bit see-through, and then a little cap toe on the very front, and just a really simple crisscross wrap at the ankle. And I feel like they're really classic, but they give a little bit of an edge to just like a traditional pointy toe pump. So I've seen like a lot of designer heels that kind of have this vibe, and these are just really affordable, and I feel like they give you that look and they look super high quality and they're just really cute and honestly these are really comfortable I wore them yesterday and I was out all day on them and like I wasn't like my feet didn't really hurt that bad I don't know I mean I guess they're really not like that high they're more like three and a half inches they're not quite four but so cute and beautiful and I feel like you can definitely wear these into winter with like a blazer and mom jeans they're just Gorgeous, I love them. And next is another pair of heels from Windsor. And these that kind of play on that clear transparent trend that is going on, but they're these really cute clear sort of sandal heels. Again, a little bit more of a tradition uh, of a transitional item. Um, they might be a little chilly going into winter unless you live in California or somewhere a little bit sunnier, but really, really comfortable and cute. It's like a mix of a nude with like these clear kind of like acrylic type heel, which is so cool. They almost give me like a little bit of Yeezy vibes, which I love. And the straps are really stretchy, comfortable plastic. They're not like, they're not like firm or sticky. They're just really nice and they have a lot of squish on them. So again, a really, really comfortable pair. I was surprised how comfy they are, but I love this trend for fall and I think this is a really cute shoe um, and, or a nice twist on a heel. It just gives a little bit of a trend, but it's still very simple and nice. Last but not least, and these are definitely a much higher end item, 
but I love them and I just had to mention them. And these are the Gucci fur slides. I wore these all last fall and winter and I'm just absolutely obsessed with them. But the reason I wanted to show them is because I've been doing a lot of research on fall shoes and I've seen a really really beautiful pair on Pretty Little Thing or Misguided, I can't remember which site it was, but there's a silver pair and they have like these pearls on the top of them. They're so cute. I'll insert a photo here, but I'm going to link those down below as well because um, I think those are a really fun twist on these Gucci slides and I feel like now you can get a million pairs that look just like this. So. I would, if I could afford to get them, I would get like velvet and metallics and like fun ones, but I think I'm gonna order those ones from Pretty Little Thing, but really cute, nice twist on a flat. They're just like a loafer and the fur keeps your feet kind of warm and they're super fashionable, so I love these. All right, you guys, that's gonna be it for my fall shoe guide. Um, I haven't quite gotten into like over the knee boots yet. I'm getting there, but I think I might do a winter shoe guide or I will continue to show you guys all the shoes that I pick up in my weekly hauls. So definitely stay tuned for that. But these are kind of some of my favorites so far for transitioning into the fall season. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll have everything linked down below. Let me know what other fashion videos you wanna see. I wanna do fall fashion trends coming up and tons of different stuff. So I love you guys. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.